Hello everybody. Have you ever thought about making your own Five Nights at Freddy's game in Roblox or any other platform? But some people realize that they suck at modeling and blending. <coughs> or maybe they don't know where to start. But don't worry. Because in this video, I will show you the way I model the animatronics. Today I will build Freddy. By the way, I will only show you how I build. So if you don't have experience with Blender, go watch some tutorials. Now let's begin. First, I will just create a place to put the models in. Name it however you like. Now, open Blender. First, save the Blender file, in the folder you made. By the way, this keyboard from the left will let you know, what keys I am pressing. After you saved it, enter in the file once again, and from there we will begin. First delete everything there. Press Shift plus A, and add a cube. After that, go to any frontal view, of Y axis. Add a subdivision modifier. Go like this and press apply. This is how your model should look like by now. From here, go to x-ray mode, and delete half of the model like this. Disable the x-ray, and add a mirror modifier. Now add another subdivision modifier. Make sure that the mirror modifier is always the top one else it won't mirror the right way. After that begin modeling. Press tab to enter edit mode, you must have something selected. The proportional editing mode will help you a lot. Use the mouse wheel to determine the radius of the proportional editor. Press left control plus R to make a cut. Press G to be able to move the points, edges, or faces around. Press R to rotate, press S to scale. To move around the object, hold the mouse wheel button, and drag around. To move around without rotation left shift plus mouse wheel and drag. There are more keybinds that you won't see on the keyboard cause the model is not the right one. Here I will make some space for the eye holes. Select one face, and press I to insert another face. This is how your model should look like. To make the holes select the face press delete, and delete faces. So far so good. Make sure to save your file as a checkpoint for your model. Make sure you make backups too. Also make collections and separate the suit and the endoskeleton. To add a collection, press right click on scene collection, then new collection. Right now I'm making Freddy's nose. Make sure that the nose doesn't clip that much through his mask. Currently, I'm not using an image reference so I'm doing this a freestyle. Maybe in another video I will show you how to build after an image. By the way, if you want to sculpt your model, make sure that your subdivision is applied. Then enter sculpt mode and start doing it. 
for the nose. Use a sphere, and before it as you like. We are done with this part as well. Time to model the ears. I don't know how good they will be. Never mod your ears before. If you guys want to see this at a slower rate you can use a slow motion and see how I do this. So far, they look good. All left is to connect them. Done with this section. Time to make the jaw. I will start like this. Till now it's getting the shape. Also, I apologize for not adding the keyboard here. Make the hole for the neck. Make the jaw a bit rounded. Time to make the hollow space inside. I will make the jaw a bit thicker, so it goes well with the head. And I'm done with this section. Time to add his teeth. The tooth is just a cube with a bevel modifier. Press L to select a separate object in edit mode, and move it. Time to make the top hat. Add a bevel modifier, and done. Time to add additional content. Now, I will add the eyebrows. It looks good. Now I will make the upper body. Which leaves us with the limbs and lower body left. This video was more of a speed modeling. By the way, you can hide stuff out of your way so you can see what you model. Go to the explorer tab in the top right and click the eye icons to hide and hide stuff.
We are almost done with the upper body. Give Freddy some decorations. First comes the buttons. Next up is the booty. Never modeled one before. I hope I won't end up with something outrageous. It doesn't look that bad. Let's give him his arms. After the head and upper body, the rest is easy. If you made it this far, can you give me a like and subscribe? It would help me a lot. Now let's go back to where we were. Now I will give him his hands. Everything looks great. Super cool. Time to make his legs. I won't give him his usual feet. I will give him some shoes. I know I know, just trust the process. Almost done. Three parts left, lower body, kneecaps and shoulders. I will prioritize his lower body. This part is an easy one, I will have it done in no time. If you are lazy like I am, you can also help yourself with some models from Sketchfab. Choose the one you like and download it. Now go and extract these in the folder that you made.
when that happens, I just lose some more time extracting again. From here, just position and edit it a bit if you want, and that's it. Now I will speed this up I have to adjust it to my model.